Hey, this is Cherry, and I'm super excited because I'm in the press room for Archer. I cannot wait for the new season, cannot wait to ask the producers and cast about the new show because it looks like it's an homage to Aliens. And let's be honest, I love Archer, but would he really take a xenophobe for pretty much anybody? Not my Archer, not my Archer. This. Congratulations on season 10 of... You too. <laughs> you too. You also... It's been a while. Uh, since? Since I've seen you and since you guys have gone back in time, you're now in 1999. Yes, we're back to the future, I guess, so to speak. Oh yeah, last season you guys were like in the... And there's probably the a couple of references to Back to the Future, I would imagine, so it works out perfectly. Have you seen the new season yet? No, I've seen just the clip that's been released. So I've seen the trailer. That's it? That's it. Do they send you guys the streamers before? Um, sometimes. Uh, I, don't, I think they're probably not done yet with the animation. So I haven't seen a full episode. I'll see it for the first time here. Ooh, you'll see it with us. Yeah, and uh, that's happened a few times where I, I think Comic-Con in San Diego I've seen the first episode of a season presented at a convention. Now, can you tell me what Archer is up to this season? I know he's divorced from Lana, and you guys are flying a space. You yes. are half owners of a it's spaceship. It's called uh, you something Seamus, right? Seamus. So, yes. yes, there's a lot of deep references going on from previous seasons, but now in space. Yeah. Uh, yes, he's divorced from Lana. Uh, still, though, the same like uh, uh, problem dynamic with everybody, <laughs> but on, on a spaceship. So as you can imagine, there's not a lot of room to, can't really leave. <laughs> and in space, nobody can hear you scream. Is that true? Yes. But I mean, it, if you're in the If ship, you're in, okay. right. Or if you're just in space. If you're just in space, nobody can hear you like scream. because floating, can you're dead. Well, for a few seconds, you're alive. Oh, right before you scream. Yes. Yeah, there's like a... <laughs> yeah. I'm not very science-y. Yeah, I don't know how it works either, <laughs> but I hope to die in space someday. Um, I want to die in bed, surrounded by my loved ones, all of them begging me to stay alive. Oh, wow. How many loved ones do you have, and how big a bed? Well, I mean, I don't have any... I'm not married, I don't have any kids, but hypothetically, I'd be married, and I'd have like five kids and four grandchildren, and they'd all be begging me to stay. No, Grandma, don't leave. We love you so. <laughs> That's so sad. I don't want to picture that. But I'd have been loved. No, that's true. But I just don't want to picture the deathbed <laughs> scene. I watch a lot of dramas where you cry and stuff. Oh, okay, yeah. Um, so that's how a good way to go, though, right, I think? I think so. Surrounded by everybody saying, don't go. Yes. How did you spend and your... And still, selfishly, you go. You yes. go. You leave them. Don't go, don't go. No, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to go. I, I think I sound selfish. <laughs> no, no. So... However it is, I hope it's, uh, it's reasonable, uh, peaceful. not so pe yeah, peaceful, as painless as possible. I know how you spent your summer. You're doing those Arby's commercials. I've done a few. <laughs> I don't spend the whole summer, thankfully. Um, but uh, yeah, yeah. How did you spend your summer? Um, working on Bob's? Uh, we did, uh, yeah, because I think we're always working on Archer and Bob's and then a couple Arby's commercials <laughs> in between. And, and then I... Uh, I went fishing uh, for the day. I don't remember the exact date, but I know I went fishing on a boat and caught a couple fish. A few fish that you got to cook and eat. Uh, we did actually cook and eat. I think it was uh, bluefish. Um. <laughs> and it was uh, improperly prepared. You are so funny. Mm -hmm. um, how? What's been one of your favorite seasons of Archer? Um, it's hard to say. Like, I really, um, um, I haven't gotten back and watched a ton. I always will, I always will like the first season, just because mm -hmm. it was the first season. Um, and there was something, like, nostalgic about it. Um, but then I liked, I, I thought uh, the first reboot season, mm -hmm. Archer Vice, was really good. Um, so I like, I think, I like those two the best. Now it's been on for 10 years, and 
sometimes I wonder, like, do you guys think every season, oh, we're not going to be here, this is our final season? And I know first season, did you guys think it would be around for this long? No, not at all. Like, at any show, I think that, I, that I've done, and probably anybody does, you just assume uh, this won't work. Um, although Archer pretty quickly, uh, like, after the first season, there was a sense that people really liked the show. And that was just from, I think it was from like Comic the first Comic Con to the second Comic Con. Like all of a sudden, there were people in the room. Like the first one, there was like 10 people. <laughs> no, maybe not 10, but like 50. And then the next, after that, there was like 500. So people like responded to the show. So there was like momentum in the beginning, but yeah. I still surprised, maybe not so much now, but certainly like the first five years, you're always like, oh, this, this is not going to work. Right? <laughs> so I've seen you on this TV show on TBS where you're playing a alien. Oh, yeah, yeah. I love uh, you in that. So often I see you in, in like shows where I get to see your, yeah. your face. No, you gotta watch Ar you got to watch Arby's ads to see me, the what, what I look like. <laughs> um... But that was called People of Earth. Um, yeah, no, yeah, it was a good show. I, I had like, so like I had a, it's not coming back. I don't think. No. Oh, it is. Maybe. I thought it was. I thought I read somewhere it was coming back. I was waiting for the. I'm not in it anymore. So yeah, yeah. I'm hoping it's coming back. I have to look that up. Did I just get fired from that show? Right. No. This, right at this no. moment. No, no, you're coming back. All right. Um, so when you come to Comic Cons, you get all the fan love. Do you see anybody dressed up as Archer in cosplay that you were just like, you have to stop and say hi? Um, well, I see him from the stage. Um, Archer, I think, uh, it's just a pretty simple cosplay, right? Like, mm -hmm. you don't have to, I have dressed. to buy a suit. Yes. Uh, I've seen the turtleneck done a few times. That's also even easier, right? You just got to buy a turtleneck. I uh, but I think people lot. are, obviously, like, you would gravitate toward the better costumes. Pam is probably a little better. Uh, Lana, of course, uh, probably the top costume, right? Because she's got the belt and the dress. The cute mini dress. Um, Archer's kind of the mo well, maybe maybe uh, uh, Chris Parnell. God, I can't remember his character's I name. I see Archer a lot at Comic Cons. He's always with pa he's always with yeah with Lana. Alana. Yes, so a I lot know. of pair ups. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I saw somebody dressed up. A lot of couples, right? In a Hawaiian shirt, and he was like drinking some sort of brown alcohol. It was very funny. Oh, that's pretty good. That yeah, I haven't that's seen clever. variations yet. I haven't seen a ton of variations of Archer. So he's always drinking. Yeah, <laughs> and they're probably really drinking, right? <laughs> no, they're drinking iced tea. You can't drink alcohol at WonderCon. That's not what it's about. You can sneak it in. You are very funny. Mm -hmm. So now that you guys are done shooting Archer for this season, mm -hmm. what new projects are you in that we can catch you in? Uh, so far, not nothing new for me. Uh, so Bob's Burgers is they're taping their ninth season now. Mm -hmm. So that's uh, on air as we speak, and we're like halfway through the ninth season. And then it got picked up for a tenth season, so we'll be doing that. Yeah, that's cool. Um, and then hopefully uh, more Archer, if, if that happens. But it's like what you said, I don't know yet. You don't know yet. Well, I'm sure they will. FX Sets loves you guys, and we love you guys. I watch you guys every year. I've been watching you since season one. Oh, thank you. FX has never told me that, but but maybe they should. It's kind of funny. I hadn't real. I hadn't put together until just now that Archer and Bob's Burgers are almost the same age. You mean uh, the character? The shows. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, they were like uh, done like six months apart. Very funny. Right, and I remember that being like really a problem because I don't, it was like, I don't remember which show was done first, but they both got picked up to series. Mm -hmm. And there was no... I don't even think I made the connection when you were like when I taped the recorded the Archer pilot. Mm -hmm. I think that was the first one. And then I recorded Bob's. I just assumed neither were going to get picked up. <laughs> so I always thought, oh no, I did the same voice. And that's not going to work, <laughs> right? They don't sound the same to me because they look so different. Well, the yeah, are so different. but early on there was a problem, um, but it worked out. Well, I love both characters. I love both shows. I got to read it go to a table read for um, Bob's Burgers oh, cool. last summer, so it was super fun. Thank you so much for speaking oh, with me, and I guess I'll have to try Arby's. 
Uh, give it a shot. Go get the curly fries. <laughs> Thank you so much for talking with me.